Hi folks, I just want to give you a quick demonstration and tutorial on how to update the firmware on your Access Pack, LiftLog or any other Sol Digital product. First thing you need to do is to check that you have the latest version of the software that connects to these products and you'll find that on soldigital.com.au, accesspack.com.au and liftlog.com.au will take you to the same place. It's pretty much as simple as clicking on the picture of your product. I'll click on an Access Pack there and under downloads you'll find the FSU application. In this case the latest version is 8.5. If you just click on that link it will install the application to your computer. What we're going to do now is we're going to run the FSU app and it will come up. Now I have a, a link to modem plugged into a USB port on the computer and I'm running the FSU app and you can see it's going and looking for things that it can connect to. Uh, to my left here I have a, an access pack uh, plugged in and there's a few other things turned on around the place as well. You can see we've got uh, some product and development. But we're going to update the firmware on this access pack. So I just, and to do that I just connect to it like I would always connect to it. And because the latest firmware for each device ships with the FSU application you can see here it's prompted me to update it. Now that number there will change depending on what version of firmware you have on on the device and uh, and this is the current firmware version. I'll click update and it'll go away and it will update that uh, that firmware over the Bluetooth link. Now it's important that you don't power off the access pack lift log IBM or or, or what have you during this process. Uh, so if it's on a if it's a, a lift log on a crane then uh, uh, make sure that that crane doesn't time out and go to sleep. Um, but other than, other than that it's a pretty innocuous process and we've done thousands of upgrades like, like this so don't be afraid to try it. Okay we're getting near the end of it now. And Bing you can see I'll we'll set the date and time. You can see that the uh, the firmware has now been updated to 4.4, and that's it. Um, the process is exactly the same no matter which product you're connecting to, uh, and and that's how you update firmware on a sole digital product.